This is Congressman Bill Cassidy. Last Thursday, House Speaker Nancy Pelosi introduced a 2,000-page, trillion-dollar health care bill. She hopes it to pass tomorrow. I'm posting a daily video blog to expose key elements of Ms. Pelosi's bill, contrasting them with Republican alternatives that cost less and are more effective. Today, the Department of Labor announced that 190,000 Americans lost their jobs in October. This brings the national unemployment rate to 10.2 percent, the highest unemployment rate since 1983. Speaker Pelosi's bill will impose $730 billion in new taxes on businesses and individuals. Now, if the power to tax is the power to destroy, in this case, the taxes destroy jobs. Using the same methodology as Dr. Christina Romer, who was the chair of the White House Council of Economic Advisors, Speaker Pelosi's tax increases will destroy over 5 million American jobs. Because Speaker Pelosi's bill does not lower health care costs, long term, the economy suffers even more. Real reform lowers health care costs. Real reform will not require $730 billion in job-killing taxes. Real reform lowers costs by empowering patients. You can read the real reform I'm co-sponsoring, H.R. 3400, on my website, www.cassidy.house.gov.